MBDA will start deliveries of the first MM40 Block 3C anti-ship missiles to the French Navy, Marine Nationale, in December 2022, according to the latest official French defense budget documentations. The 2023 defense budget request document, which was published last week, mentions that the Exocet MM40 Block 3C missiles will be delivered in December 2022. As we previously reported, these missiles were initially set to be delivered in 2021. The latest budget document shows that only four missiles will be delivered this year, with an additional 31 MM40 Block 3C missiles set to be delivered in 2023. The total number of missiles on order is 55. In addition, the French Ministry of Armed Forces ordered 45 MM40 Block 3C kits, the first ones of which, for in total, are set to be delivered in September next year. According to our information these kits will be used to turn the MM40 Block 3 missiles into the latest Block 3C variant. According to the budget document, the Exocet operation makes it possible to retain the anti-ship capabilities provided by the Exocet missile system, available in air-launched AM-39, surface-launched MM-40, and submarine-launched SM-39 variants. The operation maintains or even improves its robustness in the face of new threats as well as its implementation from new platforms. The document also mentions the following regarding the future FCAS missile, the FCAS operation ensures the preservation of the Navy's anti-ship capability post-2030 by improving the survivability performance of the existing capability. The ramp-up phase carried out jointly with the United Kingdom should make it possible to choose the option to meet the operational need prior to the launch and production. Exocet MM40 Block 3C Compared to the existing Block 3, the Block 3C variant brings to the Exocet a new digital RF seeker by Thales. The C stands for coherent. The most important benefit of coherent radar processing is the ability to differentiate relatively small differences in velocity, which correspond to small differences in phase. This coherent target processing technology offers Doppler resolution slash estimation and provides less interference and signal slash noise benefits relative to non-coherent processing. Basically, the new MM40 Block 3C will be more resistant to the latest jamming systems and is will probably, on paper at least, even be able to recognize surface vessels, thanks to the use of advanced waveforms, this means that the new seeker will potentially be able to recognize a targeted ship within a group of ships and impact specific areas of that target. This is already achieved with modern anti-ship missiles such as the LRASM and NSM, but both of these use infrared IR, seekers. While the Block 3 upgrade of the Exocet brought a longer range, 200 kilometers, thanks to a turbojet engine and the ability to strike coastal targets, thanks to GPS navigation, it used the same RF seeker as the Block 2, a 30-plus years old technology that wasn't digital. Similar upgrades on the AM-39 air-to-surface variant is not planned. However, the SM-39 submarine-launched variant could receive a seeker upgrade. These two missiles have already received a digitization upgrade of their systems bringing them to the AM-39 Block 2 Mod 2 standard for the Rafale F-3 and to the SM-39 Block 2 Mod 2 standard for the Suffren class submarines, Barracuda SSN program. The coherent seeker upgrade could bring the later missile to the SM-39 Block 3 C standard. With this latest variant of the Exocet family, which started its service in the 1970 IES with the MM38 in its inventory, the French Navy is set to have a very capable anti-ship missile until its replacement, the FCAS-W, comes along in the 2030 IES. How is the Exocet MM40 Block 3 capability? The Exocet MM40 Block 3 weapon system is the latest generation shipborne version of the Exocet family and is in operational service with several navies. Exocet MM40 Block 3 provides enhanced operational performance and technology upgrades while minimizing the impact on procurement and logistic support costs. Exocet MM40 Block 3's mission planning software module automatically computes engagement plans to support firing decisions. 
The flexibility of the Exocet MM40 Block 3 weapon is further enhanced by the accuracy of the new navigation package, allowing optimized 3D approach trajectories and terminal attacks from different azimuths at very low sea skimming altitude with simultaneous time on target. The terminal guidance relies on a sophisticated J-band active seeker to discriminate and select targets at sea and on the GPS accuracy for land targets. Exocet MM40 Block 3 is compatible with most of the logistic support assets already in service. Its launching system is interoperable with all MM40 versions, thus enabling a smooth transition to Block 3. Design The Exocet Block 3 is produced either as a new missile or using Block 2 warhead and guidance section. The turbojet engine allows for a much longer range, maneuvers at sea, and re-attack capability. The Block 3 looks somewhat different from earlier Exocet missiles. It has a new large booster section and a shorter propulsion section with four air inlets in between the four main wings. Propulsion The Block 3 Exocet uses a turbojet engine powered by JP-10 aviation fuel instead of a solid propellant rocket motor. This more than doubles the range over the Block 2 while retaining the high subsonic flight speed. The engine has four air inlets, which allows for high G maneuvers. The Block 3 can be launched from Block 2 launch tubes. Most fire control systems allow the use of both Block 2 and 3 missiles. Guidance The Block 3 retains the improved active radar homing seeker introduced in the Block 2 upgrade. The improved GPS guidance now also allows for a land attack capability. The turbojet engine is capable of maneuvers at sea, allowing a single vessel to attack a target from multiple angles. The Block 3 is also the first Exocet with a re-attack capability. In 2018 a Block 3C update was announced with improved data processing and mission planning software. The Block 3C is reportedly capable of selecting a certain target from a group of ships and selecting an optimal point of impact. Firepower The Exocet Block 3 has a maximum range of 180 to 200 kilometers while moving at high subsonic speeds. The improved range is mainly used for maneuvers at sea. The blast fragmentation warhead is of reasonable use against land-based targets and should be effective against command post equipment, SAM sites, and coastal defense systems. <laughs>